People should stop talking so much about the 115 financial charges that Man City are facing. That doesn't matter at all. The biggest scandal before us is the 2010 Ballon d'Or. Truly the biggest scandal football has ever faced. There is literally no justification for Messi winning the 2010 Ballon d'Or. After all, he wasn't even the best club player that year. The best player on club level that year was Diego Melito, who led Inter to an unprecedented treble winning season for Inter. Inter had never won the treble before this. He scored in every round of the Champions League, including dunking on Messi's head when Inter and Barca met in the Champions League semi-finals, scoring once and assisting two other goals in the first leg, and then produced the greatest Champions League final performance of the 21st century, scoring two fantastic goals against Bayern. He also scored the opening goals against Chelsea in the round of 16, and also CSK Moscow in the quarterfinals. This is arguably one of the top 5 Champions League campaigns in the 21st century. Diego Melito was undoubtedly the best player on club level that season. Yet he didn't even reach the top 30 shortlist for the Ballon d'Or in 2010. So you're telling me that Messi, who had a worse club season than Diego Melito, and then absolutely stunk it up at the World Cup, taking a record 29 shots without scoring a single goal. The most horrific performance at a major international tournament that the sport has ever seen from a supposed GOAT level player, and somehow that won him the Ballon d'Or? How does that even work? The World Cup was a negative for him. He was worse than Diego Melito on club level. So based on that alone, he should already be below Diego Melito on the Ballon d'Or ranking. And then he was absolutely horrendous at the World Cup. We should have gotten him even lower in the ranking. But somehow he wins the Ballon d'Or? That's crazy. What in the world is going on? There is zero justification for this. And by the way, I'm not saying Diego Melito should have won the Ballon d'Or in 2010. Obviously he shouldn't have. 2010 was a World Cup year. In a World Cup year, the World Cup should be at least 70% of the deciding factor in who wins the Ballon d'Or. But Messi was absolutely horrific at the World Cup, so that makes zero sense for him to win it. I think someone like Snyder or Robin should have won the 2010 Ballon d'Or. Players that were amazing in the Champions League and the World Cup and reached the finals of both competitions. But what's crazy is that this shouldn't even be about Messi versus Snyder or Robin. He objectively was far worse than Diego Melito that year and should have ranked lower than Diego Melito. Yet Diego Melito wasn't even in the top 30 shortlist and Messi won it. This is far worse than the 115 charges that Man City are facing. This is far worse than the Ponzi schemes that Bernie Madoff was conducting. This is the biggest scam of the 21st century. We need to see a proper legal investigation about this. The corruption involved. The PR involved. There must have been illegal tampering and harassment as well. Because no one will tell me that this guy deserves to win the Ballon d'Or. I propose that we launch a petition to FIFA to investigate the fraudulent 2010 Ballon d'Or, where Messi shouldn't even have been in the top five, but ended up winning the Ballon d'Or. All right, peace.